All right, so we're gonna work some self myofascial release. So self myofascial release is essentially like a self massage and we're trying to get into some tissues. Uh, you can use a foam roller or a hard medicine ball. I prefer the hard medicine ball, but if the medicine ball is too intense for you, you can go back down to a foam roller, which is a little bit softer. All right, first one we're gonna work is our rectus femoris, which is a muscle in our quad. So all you're gonna do is you're gonna lay on your quad right in the center of it and try to find a spot in between your hip and your knee that's pretty tender. And by tender, I mean pretty painful. And you're gonna find that spot and you're just gonna hold there and try to drop your weight down onto it and hold for about two minutes until that pain kind of dissipates, all right? So I'll just set a timer, hang out. I usually get my phone, set a timer there. Sometimes I'll play on Instagram or social media, hit my two minutes and switch sides. And then what you might find is that for me, like my left one is a little bit more painful than my right, so that one needs a little extra love and attention than my right side might for this particular release. And you're gonna find that different releases are gonna require different attention based from left to right side depending on how you stand and how you move throughout the day, okay? So this is our rectus femoris self-myofascial release.